Hello everybody and welcome back to another With The World Eventing vlog. We are having a dressage lesson today with Rich Hayward. Um, he comes to our yard, local. Uh, yeah, he's local I think, to our yard. So he comes once a month maybe, a bit more. And I thought, yeah, I'll go for it, I'll have a lesson with him. I haven't had a dressage lesson for a while. Um, I usually have, oh, I can't remember his name. <laughs> I can't never remember his name. but. Where I used to stable Sarah and I used to have a dress of lesson, lesson with him there, um, Nacho. Uh, but he lives abroad, so he only comes over every so often. So I wanted to make sure that I can try and start getting regular dressage lessons again. So I'm going to go with Rich and then at the end of the month I think I'm going to have a natural lesson as well. Who am I having dressage lessons? Anyway, Martha's coming along and she's going to film, so... Fingers crossed it's a good one. So as this was my first lesson with Rich, he wanted me to kind of show him how I warm up um, so he could see how Seren went and how I was riding. So what I find a lot with Seren is that she falls in quite a lot and she's not really going anywhere in the trot, like it's just getting us by. So Rich spotted that straight away and made some changes quickly. And so you need to take her up one gear, two gears in the trot because it's high and are basically just coming along for the ride. So think of her shoulders and her ribs coming out to the right. There, now take a little bit of flexion to the left as you think of pushing and uh, take your outside rein a little bit away from her neck and put that inside leg on so you give her room to bring the body out to the right. There, now make her a little bit softer to the left. Take a little bit of flexion left, but keep pushing the body right. Realise where she's got to go with the body and the neck and the hind legs and everything else. That's better, that's better. That's coming slowly. Yeah. Good, and again, think, so think of that so you take the right rein a little bit away from the neck, and when you put the left leg, you want the shoulders to fill that gap in the rein. The way he explained that made so much sense, and it just clicked for the rest of the lesson then. Go. Good. And again, so you think, give her a little bit of room with the right rein to come out to the right. Take the flexion to the left and you make her more off the left leg that she fills that gap in the rein. That's it. And just stay with it. She's got to work. Good. She's got to work. That's it. We'll keep the push from her hind leg. Yes. There. Lovely. Good. There you go. Good. That's it. Very good flexion there, because there she fell into your left leg. A little flexion, give her room with the right rein to fill the gap. The left, that doesn't matter. That's it. Yeah, good, good. Yeah, very good there, lovely. One more circle here, and then you can change the right. Left leg, a little bit of space with the right rein. Flexion to the left. Forward, forward, forward. Yeah, well done. Yeah, left leg, flexion left. Ah, good. 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 Good Yeah, right, change the right. You're going to be busy with that poop scoop. She's a bugger. <laughs> I know, it's hardly worth doing. I know. Let's call a shitty Welsh, not Wizzy Welsh. So this is Seren's worst rain and what I feel is that she kind of leans to the outside and kind of curls her head. Yeah, so take that shoulder to the left, give her a little bit of space with the left rein to come out to the left. That's it, yeah. That's it. Good, good. That's it. Good. And because she's so green, you've got to be very um, sort of ABC about it. As in, give her room to come out. Yeah. Say to her, this almost used her natural thing. If if all bends that way, it's going to fall that way. Yeah. Good. Flexion. Give her room to fall a little bit to the outside. To help you give it the flex. There. Good. 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 That's good. it. Very good. Go on, Ad. Go on, stay there. Stay there. Just stay there. Just stay. Stay with it. Stay with it. Just stay. And don't let her. Not at all. She's got to make mistakes in order to learn how not to make them again. Yeah. 
Good. That's it. That's it. Stay with it. Good. Well done. Right foot. That's better. Good. Now you're starting to get a bit of swing through her body. Then another little flexion. Put the left leg. Give her room to come out to the left. That's it. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. Good. Go on. Go on. Just stay there. Well done. That's it. Stay with it. Just stay with it. Good. Well done. Ah, oh, good. There. Ah, super. Good. Very good. That's better. Better. Good. A little bit right leg. Okay. Ah, oh, well done. Stay with it. Stay with it. Yeah. Stay there. That's it. Good. Good. Well done. Very good. Right. Green. Yeah. And you're just getting a little bit. You're just overcomplicating it a bit. Yeah, go on, you can be brutal with me. <laughs> she won't cry. You're shit. <laughs> now you're just overcomplicating it in that break it down of like, so what do you want? You want her to throw around, you want her to be able to bend left and bend right. Yeah. And in order to do that, you've got to think, well, Instead of thinking, well, it doesn't, it falls and then it doesn't bend this way, it doesn't bend that way, and da 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 da. Yeah. Think, well, like this way, because she gets a bit stiff. It's like, so you want her to bend there, why doesn't she bend there? Yeah. It's because her body also goes there when you go to bend it. Yeah, yeah. So say to it, uh, you want her off your left leg, yeah. give her room with your, your, with your left hand to, to move the, the body right. out to the left, yeah. that then she can fall the, neck, fall the neck over to the right. Yeah, that's, that's what I was feeling like, how you explained it with the give her room and then let yeah. her fall into it. Yeah. That really makes sense. And then eventually the more she gets sort of happier and the idea of that, then you can sort of catch that falling out idea yeah. with your outside ring and then put the connection in. Yeah, because that's true riding to the outside hand, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. But first you've got to give her the yeah. idea. At the moment she doesn't, you put your inside leg on, you give her an outside rein and she's like, what? what that. <laughs> so you've got to first get her from your inside leg the idea that she travels from your inside leg to the outside yeah. and then you catch that then eventually with your outside rein and be like there's your connection. Yeah. Yeah, that makes so much sense. Good girl. Good. Good girl. Good. 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 Okay, then when you're ready take your trot again. dropping back behind you. Ah, well done, that's it, stay with it. That's it, and you've, it's all about feeling. Yeah. Good, good. That's it. Feel where the neck is, feel where the body is. Feel where the speed is going. Feel the push from the hind legs. Is she pushing? Is she go, coming over her back from her hind legs? Good, good. It's a nice drop. Ah, very good. Right, after this circle then, change the rein again. And as you come across the diagonal to change the rein, feel about changing the bend in the body with the legs, yeah. changing the flexion, keeping the same speed. That's it. Good trot. That's it. Keep that forward push. And your little flexion to the left. A bit left leg. Yeah. Go on, that's it, feel the shoulders come out to the right hand. 
She's just a little bit against you in the pot. That's better. That's better. Go on, take it. Take the flexion. Put the left leg. Good. Good. That's better. Good girl. That's it. Good. Good. That's it. Little more. That's it. Good. 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 There. That's better. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Well done. Good girl. Right, let her have a little stretch and then we'll have a have a go at the gallop. <laughs> That's why I haven't got a mic on me. Yeah, like, I haven't I haven't mic'd him but it's picking it up. Oh yeah. Richie's voice carries and <laughs> yeah. like. have a look at the gallop here. <laughs> Is that what we're calling it because it's full beat? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh dear. Right, come on, let's go. Right, so get the trot back where you just had it, that you can just have a little flexion, you can soften the neck. Good. Now, no slower than that. Now, a little flexion to the left, move the body to the right. Like you just did in the trot. Go on. Let the she let go a little bit. Yeah, move the body, flex the neck. Just stay with it. It'll feel horrendous at the moment, but don't go with it. Yeah, then let go. Good. That's it. That, then you need a little bit of the leg there when you let go. Yeah. The problem is you've put all the responsibility on sorting the canter onto yourself. Yeah. Flex the neck, make her soft, say to her, you've got to carry me. Because at the moment she doesn't carry you in her middle. No. Ah, good, good, good. There. Stay with it, little flex. Move the body. Yeah, now let go. Now put the leg on. Good. Good, good, there, that's best. The left side of her body. Stay with, yeah, now let go. Now close the leg. Good, 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 good. Your leg on to say to her, now you've got to bring the hind leg to support yourself. And at the moment, because it's so green, you've got to have enough tempo in her hind leg to be able to carry herself. She's good. Good, good, good there, good there, yeah, good. And the longer she stays soft there, the softer you, the longer you stay soft. Wow. Come on. See, it's funny how when you get them to let go and get them to be a bit looser, yeah. how then you've got to start pedalling. Because something like this, this, this that goes, you said like, goes really quick and goes fast everywhere. Yeah. Now it's suddenly not going any very fast. <laughs> Good. Flex a little bit to the left. Push the body a little bit right. Yeah, forward, forward. That's it. Good, good, good. And then when you're ready, take the canter again. Good canter. That's a better rhythm and a better speed. Now move, flex a little bit, move the body. Put more responsibility on her to actually carry you. Yeah. Good. Now let go. Now good. the leg. Good. You say to her, bring the hind leg forward to carry yourself. Good. Good. Yeah, left leg, a little bit push right. Flex a little bit left. Yeah, go on, flex a bit. Yeah, then let go. Good, good, good. You've got to build this bridge from her hind leg over her back to the bit. Yeah. The moment you haven't got a bridge. That's it, well done. Little flexion there. Move her off the left leg. Yeah, good. Good, good, yeah, good there, good girl. Good, good, good. Left leg, push to the right. There, she's on a little little bit on the left shoulder. So, ah, well done. Lovely, lovely leg. That's it, yeah. Sandra, bring the, bring the hind leg. Good, well done, well done. Flexion, off the left leg. Ah, good, yeah. Think, keep moving that body. Make her stay loose through her middle. Flex, left leg. Good leg, leg, left leg, good, 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 good. Yes! Ah, well done. Good there. A little bit more flexion left. Push her off the left leg. So you push her off that left side of her body. Ah, well done. 
Good, good. Now you're getting it from a hind leg a little bit more over the back down to the back. Good. Yeah. Now, no wonder you're so fit. Huh? No wonder you're so fit. Why? I'm knackered. <laughs> <laughs> good. Yeah, super. Lovely. Now she's swinging from her hind legs. Yeah. Very good. Right. Give her a little walk. Good. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah, she just doesn't have that lift, does she? Huh? She doesn't have that lift. No, but it's like all of this work, it's like, it's nothing special to do with like you, her, and, or anything else. I yeah. do this work, whether it be with you on her that's green, yeah. or whether it be me on the black horse, my Grand Prix horse. Yeah. It's all the same thing. Like, I'll get on him to warm him up and I'll be like, can I move his shoulders? Can I flex it? Can I move it there? Can I move it there? Yeah. And I, I, I keep all of that, whether it be just trotting it, the black horse round, yeah. or whether it be doing a PF, whether it be doing a canter pirouette, I think, where's its hind leg? Where's its body? Where's its shoulders? Where's its neck? Yeah. Good girl. Good girl, Seven. Bless her. She's really quick at learning. Yeah, but I mean the biggest problem with you is, yes, it's, it's not the strongest behind. Yeah. But your weakest part is a middle bit. Okay. You haven't, she doesn't do that. Yeah. She just sort of, the hind legs do this, the yeah. front legs do this, and the middle bit never connects them all. Yeah, yeah. Right. Let's have a look at galloping this way. <laughs> Trot settle this way. So be able to get the reaction from the right leg. That's it. Good. That's it, yeah. That's good. Now it's looking more like a whole horse. Good. Yes, good. And a little flex again, a little bit the right leg. Yeah. Good. Well done. Ah. Oh, let go. <laughs> Yeah, good, good. That's it. And if you feel when you put your right leg on that you feel her give a little bit in her ribs, yeah. then she doesn't need to move quite so much to the side. Good. Now think of the, her letting go in the body here. Uh -oh. it, just stay with it. It'll, it. it'll feel horrendous at the moment, but yeah. go with it. Yeah, now let go. Good, then a little flexion again, a little bit the right leg. Yeah, good, good, yeah, that's it. And keep playing a little bit with that, moving the body, making the softness to the right. Stay with it, just stay with it there. Good, let go, yeah, good. Then another little flexion, a little bit the right leg. Stay with it, stay with it. Stay there, yeah. She's got to ah, let go. Yeah, as soon as she lets go a little, there. Good. Now again, a flexion and a, and a bit right leg. Yeah, stay, 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 stay. Yeah, well done. That's it. Good, good. Yeah, yeah. Ah, good. Well done. Good girl. That's it. Stay. That's it. Keep playing with that. Little flex, little bit inside leg. So a lot of this is just me simply asking for a little bit of half halt, then asking for her to bend towards the inside, so flex her towards the inside, but give her room with my outside rein and use my inside leg to kind of guide her into that gap. Um, and this is her weakest rein. This is where she is four beats still a bit, um, a bit, a lot. <laughs> um, and this is the thing with horses sometimes you have to trust the process like it has to be ugly before it's better so she's very four beat here and she's always struggled with this rain but what rich is saying is that i don't she doesn't have the strength in her core to kind of bridge the front and back end so there's a little bit of bridge in there but that's just going to take time just to build her core i've took time to build her back end and now it's time to get her working properly over her back properly through pushing in the back end and 
build that core basically so that we bridge the front end and the back end together. Ah, good. That's it. Well done. Good trot there. Yeah, now she's really swinging. Good. Good. Move her off the right leg again. Oh, very good. good. Lovely. Side when you flex, huh? Yeah. Then do do give a little half out on the outside when you flex. Ah, yeah. good, good. Yeah, little flexion. Stay there. Stay there. Yeah, good, 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 good. Yeah, little flexion, half out inside leg. Yeah, good, 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 good. Flexion, half out, inside leg. Go on, go on, that's it. Yes, well done. Good, 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 good. Yes, 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 yeah, good. Good, good, good. Then take your trot. Flexion, right leg. Good, make a soft. That's it. Ah, good, good. Flexion there, yes. That's it. Good there. Right. Have a little walk. Good. Good. <sighs> Getting there. Yeah. Like I said, she can't really go any slower at the moment. The only way she'll go slower is if you do what you do. Yeah. And literally get hold of the front and you literally ride the front, ride the back, <laughs> and you put it together. That's how it feels. Like yeah. It. And that's how it looks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's got to learn. It's a little bit like, you've got to think, if like if you canter down to a massive fence on it, yeah. it's going to come down to a massive fence and it's going to go back itself off, back itself off, back itself off. Yeah. That's the feeling it's got to get in itself on the flat. Yeah. At the moment, it goes, I'm going to gallop forward because you're going to sort it out. Yeah. Whereas she's got to gallop forward like that, you've got to keep making it soft and be like, no, no you've got you, to balance yourself. Yeah. yeah, she's got to balance herself on her own legs, which is what she doesn't do at the moment because she's weak in her middle. Yeah. But like I said, it's got to be this bridge. Yeah. You've got its hind legs coming here. You've got the other end of the bridge here, which is your hand. Yeah. When you bring those two together, then she should lift up in the middle. At the moment, she doesn't. No. She brings the bridge from this end forward and all it does is gallop off into your hand and she's like well you're going to sort it out yeah and you've got to keep make you've got to make the softness at the moment so, yeah and get her a bit stronger in her back to then be able to go right now i'm taking this end of the bridge and i want you to come a little bit more in your back a little bit more in your back yeah and that only comes with time yeah exactly this is it but it's not a quick fix is it no but it's not canter. <laughs> yeah I, I mean where you're at at the moment you've done the quick fix mm. and it sort of got it to where it is now mm -hmm. but you ain't going to get any further no that's it and that's why i've, I've got <laughs> <to> move it. <laughs> oh god <laughs> right have a little walk and then we'll just do another little minute in the trot we don't want to break her no or me well yeah exactly Never mind, no. <laughs> that's it so i think now keep a little bit there the frame so she don't let her quite so long now just in the trot just to finish with yeah think have a little bit contact cars but you have the same principle that you did when she was sort of taking you down on the bed think where are where's her shoulders where's her hind leg where's her body a little bit of flexion push her to the outside flex her a little bit inside so you get that, the, yeah, the, yeah, good, good, good girl. that's it, and now ride a little bit more forward in the trot, but without going long, say to her, I want a little bit more tempo in your hind legs, but still with the same, that it's not your responsibility to manage it, Yeah. that's it, yeah, Good, good, that's it, good, lovely there, that's a nice swinging trot, very good, but still think, where's her hind legs, where's her middle, where's her shoulders, where's the neck going, 
is the body getting in the way of the neck being soft to the left. Yeah. Good. Yeah, That's good it. Job. Yeah, good. Good. Very good. Now just take a lies like this and even on the straight line. Still feel that she's not falling into your inside leg, but you can still take a bit of flexion even on a straight line to make the softness to the inside. When you get down the bottom, you can change the rein again. That's it. Hold on. Yeah, left leg, left flexion. Ah, oh, well done. That's it. Now bring the right leg on. Move the ribs a little bit to your left. Into a le little bit left contact though now. That's it. Ah, good. Good. That's it. Then you can take a circle here once this way. That's it. So you give her a little bit contact on the outside now. Keep riding forward. Yeah. Good, well done. That's it, go on, push forward through it. That's it. Then go large. <coughs> Good. Good. That's it. And think of a staying off your right leg, as soft in the ribs on the right. Good. That's it. That's it. Go on, ride forward. Ah. Yes. Good. Well done. Good now the right leg. Push her off the right side. That's it. Little half bolts on the left. Yeah. Ah. ah. There. That's it. <coughs> Good. Little half out the left there. There, but keep the ah, good, yes, good, very good. And circle up here, good. Yeah, right leg, right ah, well done, good, good. That's it. And see if you can take a right down now and really open the back up and stretch it. Very good. It's still with a little contact though, you want her to take you down. Don't just chuck the rein at it. <laughs> That's it. Little bit of flexion there. Push her from the right leg. Into your left hand a bit. Yeah, within the stretch. Good. That's it. Very good. Lovely. Good. Good. That's it. Very good. So Seren stretching down like this is absolutely amazing, especially on her worst rain, because usually when I'm coming towards you now, she would have her head to the outside slightly, and it kind of looks curled, and it feels horrible. But she's actually tr like she's actually stretching through her rib cage, and everything just feels so light and floaty, and it all feels really correct. And like what Rich was saying, I got a feel for it all, which has helped me good. to be able to take that away from that Very lesson good. and then school her differently. Build the bridge. Yeah. What do you think of her? She's very sweet. She's just very weak. Yep. Very weak in her middle. Yeah. Uh, you're not going to get her any stronger behind than what you have until you build the middle up, really, because your hind leg's not going anywhere. Yeah. It's like you, so you, as like I said, you've got to have... She's got to push from here to build the back to then get strong behind. At the moment, that the hind legs are strong as it can be yeah. from just coming along for the ride. Yeah. You've got to get the push, which is where sort of your full beat comes from. Is you've got no, you're well, lacking got middle. Yeah. In that the hind leg does one thing, the front leg does the other, and she's just learnt to do a rhythm that sort of gets everything out the way in some sort of order. Okay. The, the stronger you get her to pick her back up and stronger in the middle, the more you'll get a a, a, a stronger three-beat canter because yeah. it's got to... You've got to think it's like dribbling a ball. Mm -hmm. the, the, the more you go forward, the stronger you dribble the ball. Yeah. 
the more you come back, the quicker you dribble the ball. Yeah. And at the moment, it's like you've only got one speed of dribbling the ball that way. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, the middle doesn't do enough at the moment yeah. to be able to come shorter for the ball to dribble, to be dribbled quicker, that she gets quicker in her hind leg within the rhythm. All she does at the moment is when you try to come backwards, is she slows the hind leg down, yeah. but the front leg keeps doing the same amount. <laughs> So yeah. she's, she's just got to get, it, it's just it's basically your connection. Yeah. Your yeah. connection from her hind leg to the bit. Yeah. Through her back. Yeah. Needs getting better. Yeah. And will it, will it just build naturally? Like, yeah. what do I do that kind yeah. of work? Yeah. yeah. Okay. The softer you get her, the more you say yeah. to her, right, I want you here, I want you soft. I'm not going to manage the forwardness. Yeah. Yes, you can give her a little half hold and say, not quite that quick. Yeah. But then you've got to let go. Yes. Put it on to her. Yeah. That's really hard to like. That is really on. hard. <laughs> yeah. You've got to think. You've got to say to her, this rhythm, this speed, now it's your job. Yeah. Yeah. Because the more you hang on to it and try to slow it down, the more it just gallops into the bit. Yeah. And, and then you're managing everything. Yeah. The hard. hind leg is just sort of doing this thing. The front leg's doing this thing. And she's like, well, it's your job to sort out the speed. It's not my job. <laughs> I just go whatever pace I want. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> okay. Well, she's very sweet. She's a very nice pony. She's cute, isn't she? She is really cute. She's a horse in a pony's body. Yeah. She really is. Yeah. I wish you were a horse, Erin. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Very, very good. Thank you very much. That's all right. You're no coming. Worries. Sorry. You're good girl. <sighs> very good. Very Amazing. cute. She's cute, isn't she? Yeah. She's a devil, though, in disguise. The Wizzy Welsh. She's a Wizzy Welsh, yeah. That's what we call you, isn't it? <laughs> have you maniac. seen Have you seen the viral hunt video? No. You bloody hag! <laughs> <laughs> so that was my first lesson with Rich Haywood, and I am definitely going to have some more. Th big thank you to Martha for filming and making reels as well. Top multitasker. So yeah. I will leave you with some of that gorgeous footage now.